Hi, my name is Kelly, and I'm here today to help you focus and relax by drawing little patterns. In each video, I teach you something new to draw, and I want you to follow along with me as close as you can. But at the end of the video, you will have time to be a little bit creative and add some more details of your own. Okay. To do this today, you just need something to write with and something to write on. You can write with a pencil, a pen, a marker, a crayon, whatever you have, it's okay. And anything you have that you can write on. I have a piece of paper that I folded in half, so I'm using a half sheet of paper, but you can use a piece of scrap paper or a piece of cardboard or a piece of construction paper. It can be colorful. It doesn't matter anything that you can write with and write on okay so for today we're gonna to start by drawing a square and I'm gonna make the square about the size of my hand about the size of the fingers on my hand like that and you can see that my square is a little bit crooked and a little bit wiggly and that's okay. Okay, now I'm going to put some lines across and down and I wanna make some boxes that I can draw in. So I'm gonna make each line about the same width as my finger. And it's okay if you get to the bottom and you've got one that's really wide and one that's really small, that's okay. Then I'm gonna go down this way. And maybe I'll make one that's really big and some that are small. It doesn't matter, whatever you want. I think I have about 16 boxes. It's okay if you have more, it's okay if you have less. Okay, so to make this fun shape today, we're going to be drawing what looks like a square. I'll draw one right here. So we're gonna draw the three sides and when we get to the fourth side, we're gonna stop. And then we're gonna go back in, down, over, up, over. So it makes like a square spiral. So I'm gonna start that in my first box. I'm gonna go over, but I'm gonna stop. Then I'm gonna go down and stop. Over and stop. And I just keep doing that. Up and stop. Over and stop. Until you fill up that box. My next one is a big one. So I'm gonna start, I'm gonna go all the way and then stop. I'll zoom in a little bit so you can see that easier. And I go down and stop, over and stop. The important thing is that you go slow. If you go fast, your lines get pretty messy. So go slow, we've got lots of time. Keep making your lines and stopping. I like how that looks. Go to your next one. Make your first line and stop. Also, if you go too fast, your square can fill up really quick like this. And we don't really want that. We also don't want your lines to be round. So by making one line at a time and stopping, a line and stopping, if you stop at each line, you have more control and it looks better. I filled in my whole top row. I'm gonna go down to the next row. Okay, 
check and make sure you're holding on lightly to your pen or pencil or marker. You don't have to squeeze it too hard. Some of your boxes are going to have more lines than others. I like that some boxes are big and some boxes are small. And it should start to get easier for you as long as you keep going slow. It should get easy for you each time you make one. Remember to make a line and stop. If you don't stop, it ends up being curvy. Look at how cool these look. I hope yours look amazing. I have one more row and I'm not going to hurry. I'm gonna take my time. I'm going to stop talking for about one more minute and I'm going to let you try to finish these boxes. If you get done early, just take a deep breath. Look at how cool your work is and then we'll draw some more. Go ahead and finish those up. It's okay if yours looks different than mine. It's supposed to look different than mine. We're different people. Okay, we're gonna stop and move on to something else. If yours is not filled in yet, that's okay. You can fill them in a couple minutes. We'll have some extra time. But right now, we just did this on a box with all of these little boxes. And now I wanna show you how to do it without boxes. So I'm just gonna pick another spot on my paper and I'm gonna make one of those. I'm gonna go over, down, over, up. Over, down, over, up, over. I might even have room to do one more, okay. So after we make one of them, we can connect another one. So for this one, I'm going to start by going down, over, up, over, down, over. Look how cool that looks. Maybe I'll start one going down first. We can just keep on making these. I 
You could make little tiny ones. And you can make big ones. But whatever you do, go nice and slow. I just made a long one or a tall one. And sneak them into little spaces. It doesn't matter what direction your first line goes. It can go up, it can go down, or it can go to either side. Just start by making a line in any direction. And then you make that square spiral shape. I'm going to give you one more minute to work on this. If you want to fill in more boxes or you want to do them this way, either way is okay. And on the box that I made, I can always add another row. Look at that. I just made another row. So one minute to make some more. Please don't hurry. Take your time and relax. About 10 more seconds. And stop. Okay, take a look at your picture. Please put your markers down. Take a look at your picture and look at how cool it looks. Look what a great job you did. Now this is something that you know how to make and you can draw this over and over again every day if you want. Whenever you feel like doing a little drawing, you can make this cool shape. It's so much fun. If you have color crayons or colored pencils or markers and you want to color these in, you can. You can also draw things around them. You could draw little people walking on them, whatever you want. So much fun. I hope you liked it. If you're sitting by other people that are drawing, I want you to hold yours up and show them very quietly. And I want you to look at somebody else's and I want you to tell them, that looks amazing, or good job, or I like how you made your lines, or that looks cool. Tell them something nice. Yours looks amazing. I hope you had fun, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.